Hey everybody, this is Brett, and tonight I'd like to do some comparisons, some too much or not enough types of comparisons in regards to a lot of different things in our lives. And this will give you an idea of where my mind is and how I understand, how I've come to understand things and why I've made so many changes to my own lifestyle. So, let's see. How about the cost of housing is too much or not enough? You think that the ha that houses need to be more technical and more advanced and that they should cost more, they should be bigger, etc. Or they should be simpler and smaller and you shouldn't have to pay for 30 years. You shouldn't have to, to pay that much money for that long a period of time. Which one do you think it is? Write it down below. Okay, so school loans. They just don't cost enough. There should be more hours and more teachers and bigger campuses, campuses and more books and more computer everything there should be more of everything and they should cost more and we should be paying for a longer period of time or everything should be simplified and we should be paying for a lot shorter period of time a lot less money which one um cars the another thing that most people really need in their lives um People drive too much or they don't drive enough. People should be driving a lot more, like for vacations, and they should be driving farther to their works, etc., etc. Or they should be living closer to their work and not driving as, like, for long vacations to see relatives for Christmas and Thanksgiving and yada, 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 vacations in the summer. Um, you tell me which one. And how about the cost of cars? Cars should be a lot more technical. They should be a lot more luxurious and there should be a lot more electronics and this and that. And therefore the car should cost more. I'm told we're totally good with the cars costing more. They should all cost 50 grand now. And it's cool if we pay for 10 years on them. And and it's okay if all the parts to re replacement parts cost more too. We don't mind about that. Or cars should be really, really simplified. <clears throat> and the parts should be super cheap. And cars should last a long time. And um, we should only have to pay for a, for a short period of time. A year. And the car's paid off. You tell me which one you think it should be. Okay, so I'm trying to reveal how badly, very badly, out of balance this world is. How about this one? The government doesn't spend near enough money on programs. All kinds of social programs. Or, the government spends way too much money on things. How about this one? People don't do near enough prescription drugs. They should be consuming at least three bottles a day. <laughs> Just a lot more, anyway, of prescription drugs than they do here in America. Or, people need to consume a lot less. How about this? People go to the doctor not near enough as they should. People should go to the do uh, medical doctors a lot more. Or, they should do their own healing and go to doctors a lot less. People should use herbs more or people should use conventional medicine more. Which one is it? Depends on a lot of different things, doesn't it? If they continue to eat all of those baked goods and cheese and 
too much meat and yada yada yada, then maybe they'll just have to keep going to doctors and filling themselves full of drugs. Sorry, I got off onto a tangent there. I'm supposed to just ask questions. How about... The United States spends a lot, not near, actually not near enough money. They don't spend near enough money on defense, defense, quote unquote, with our military all over the world. In every, damn near every country, we have a military base. We, we don't spend enough, though. We should have more more military bases, more tanks, more planes, more nuclear, more guns, more everything, ships. We need a lot more of all of that because we just don't have enough. And we need to continually build up our military presence bigger and bigger. And we want to spend more money. 700 billion ain't enough. We need to spend a trillion a year. On that note, President Trump is an awesome president. He is such a great person, and that's why all of his cabinet mem members have stayed strong with him. Or, President Trump has a lot of business sense, but that's pretty much it. Which one is it? Or, <laughs> we could go on with that, he doesn't really have that much business sense, he just thinks that he does, and he's had to have several bankruptcies up to this point to finally get his shit together. We could go on and on about that. He's really cordial, or he's a total asshole. Is Trump cordial and nice and kind and considerate, or is he a full-on stinky asshole? Which one is it? <laughs> I mean, <laughs> some people think it's one way and some people think it's the other way. Trump made campaign promises just to get elected, or he made campaign promises because he honestly cares about our country. I don't know. Which one do you think? I'm not making any kind of a personal statement. I'm just giving you a black and white scenario that you can answer either way. How about people need to own more guns? People in the United States just don't own enough guns. We need to start manufacturing more and more guns because everybody needs to increase their surplus plus of weapons, especially automatic weapons. You never know. The government may go haywire, and we may have to fight against our own military. <laughs> or, people need to get real and stop doing extreme things like buying guns. Which would it be? People need more guns, or people need less guns? How about gaudy materialism things? Like big trucks and stuff like that. Like people need to to buy vehicles that burn more gasoline like big ass trucks and diesel trucks and yada yada. Or people need to buy convenience cars. Convenient cars. Is that the word I'm looking for? Economical cars. <laughs> Which are convenient. <laughs> How about People just exercise outside way too much. It's just ridiculous how much people are outside working out. Walking and running and exercising and having various communal sport activities with other people. They just do that way too much or they spend a lot, way too much time in their houses playing with their devices, <laughs> their devices, <laughs> and um, watching television, etc. And they're not getting outside near enough. Which do you think it is? Um, and once again, with the houses, people spend way too much time building their own houses. Or is it that 
people don't spend near enough time working on their own houses and they're spend giving all their money to some contractor to build some mass-produced tract house that looks exactly the same as everybody else's in their neighborhood. There's another thing. People are, are uh, very, very unique. So people are all so totally unique in their lifestyles and everything. People are so like artistically unique. Or is it that people are all clones? They're all doing the same freaking thing. They get up, they go to work, they're nine to five, doing the, everyone has the same kind of a job. You've got CPAs, you've got lawyers, you've got cl store clerks, you've got this, you've got that. You, you know, all the same kind of jobs. Plumbers, electricians, da, 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 nurses. <laughs> or is it that there's just way too many unique job positions out there? There's too many people are doing unique things and it's just so scary for us that people are so enjoying their unique jobs. People donate way too much money to charities that they really care about. That's just way too much because they have so much extra income because their housing and their cars and their school loans and the cost of all the other things, food, etc., is so low that people are donating. They have so much extra money that they donate it all to charities. Or is it that people are so freaking tight, no matter how much money they make, because they've, they're spending it all on all of this materialism, that they don't have any money hardly left over to make donations to charities? What is it? People don't get enough nutrients in their foods or they get too much. People eat too much or they don't eat enough. Here in America, specifically. People eat too much or they don't eat enough and they don't get, they, they still don't get enough nutrients or they get way too much nutrients in their foods. And how about also, <clears throat> the foods are, are toxic, polluted, etc. or they're really super clean and nutritious. Which one is it? Or, you know, I mean, some one person might have one opinion and another person might have another opinion. Um, let's see, people have too much sex or they don't have enough sex. People have too many kids, there are too many people in the world, or there are just not enough people in this world. We're wor really worried about the population. We need to get fucking and making more babies. And so um, there's just seven billion, seven plus billion. It's not enough, we need more. So people are really educated, really, really smart on birth control, natural birth control, or is it that they don't know very much at all? I think I could do this for hours. I could go on and on and on. People really care a lot and make a lot of effort towards preserving the environment or people don't generally do that much at all when it comes down to it. Which one do you think? So, you know, I think about these things a lot. I've thought about them for years and years. And I said to myself, I don't know that I really want to be a part of this. Some people think that I'm angry at people. Yup. <laughs> That's safe to assume. And it's because I would say that in every single instance there, 
people are fucked up. <laughs> and so, um, man, I'm just trying to open some eyes, that's all. And um, I'm sure that a lot of you also see things this way, my way. And I didn't even say which way I was thinking in any of those regards. So I want to thank you for joining me. And remember that I survive by making products on my sewing machine right now. For people that really want high quality products that last for a long time. And are totally natural and pretty much organic. Thanks for joining me.